when he'd get angry, he would begin to start punching things. And at first, it was just the walls. On Giovanni's first birthday, he ended up beating up my baby daddy, his dad. And when I tried to leave, he pinned me up against the wall and basically held me hostage is the best way of putting it. My best friend became really, really scared of what was going on, and so she went and called the police. But unfortunately, I was too afraid to answer the door because Garrett was very, very threatening. My family convinced me to stay, and so I ended up staying in the relationship. I knew that he would touch me, but I didn't see him touch my son. So, which, looking back at it now and learning more about that now, I've learned that if your abuser can touch you, they most definitely can hurt your child. I remember when I gave birth to our child, one of the things that I regret the most was the hospital asked me, do you feel safe going home? And I said yes. Looking back at that, I should have said no. Because three weeks after my daughter was born, my son died.